Hello everyone and welcome back to Nate the Hoof Guy. On today's video, we have got a cow with a white line defect in her left front foot. So without further ado, let's get started. The first thing you're going to notice on this particular trim is how dark the claws are on this cow. That is not problematic. That is simply pigmentation or the hoof color, natural hoof color. Typically with a Holstein, they're going to be mainly white horn with a little bit of black modeled in. These happen to be mainly dark with a little bit of white modeled in. Now, if you look at her hide color, she's obviously got the look of a Holstein, but these claws are telling us that there's probably a little bit of Swiss or Jersey bred into this cow. Now that we've got this foot trimmed up, let's get the knife out and address this white line defect. Now, if you've been watching my channel for a while or you've scrolled through my videos, you might wonder, why do all of these cows have foot problems? Is that all you do is fix problems on cow's feet? And the answer is no. Throughout the course of a week, I might trim anywhere from 800 to 1,000 cow's feet. I'm only showing you one or two of those feet each week. The reason I happen to highlight these uh, defects or ulcers and different problems in a cow's foot simply because it's more interesting to watch me work on. In reality, of those 800 to 1,000 feet that I work on, the vast majority have absolutely nothing wrong with them. In fact, keeping them in that great shape is what avoids problems like this. If we can keep that foot balanced, keep that pedal bone positioned properly inside that foot, a lot of these problems are avoided. If you'd like to see more of those maintenance type trims, just those trims to keep these feet in great shape, I've got another channel called Hoof Trimming ASMR. I'll put a link to that in the description below and you can go check that out. That is doing exactly what I talked about, keeping good feet in good shape to avoid hoof problems. What we've got here is a white line defect. What does that mean? That means that outside wall in that sole, the junction that holds those two together has got a problem in it. And that problem allows bacteria to enter and ultimately infect the foot. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna put a rubber block on that other claw to elevate this problem claw off the ground. Give it time to heal and for that white line to regrow and develop properly. Once that happens, the risk of infection goes way down. Zooming in here, you can see exactly what's causing this cow the discomfort. That's the area we need to get healed up. A thorough cleaning with chlorhexidine and a salicylic acid wrap is going to get that corium all healed up, producing good quality horn once again. She actually had a little bit of dermatitis on her back foot, which I wrapped up as well. And here you can see that front foot with that block on, elevating that injured claw off the ground. Now let's let her go and see how she's walking with that block on. 
All right, guys, as always, thanks for watching. Special shout out to the math students at Central Middle School in Kansas City, Missouri. We will see you all on the next one.